Most of the pandemic medical experts have said any mask is better than no mask, but now the CDC is considering an update to its mask guidance, recommending that people wear N95 masks instead of cloth masks. Joe Hankey explains the difference. For many people during the COVID-19 pandemic, their go-to mask has been a cloth one. So for those who are considering switching, what's the difference between a cloth mask and wearing an N95 mask? And we look at the cloth mask, it actually provides the least amount of filtration against these all important uh, particles at about 26.5%. Dr. Jane Morgan, executive director of the COVID task force with Piedmont Healthcare, says that is why if you wear a cloth mask, you should consider double masking. Dr. Danny Brandstetter, WellStar's director of infectious disease, says with N95, the difference is in the name. The biggest difference is the filtering material. So the 95 is to indicate that it filters out 95% of particulate matter. One way to visually see the difference is with a candle on this cupcake. With a cloth mask, I can blow it out. But with an N95 mask, Good luck making that birthday wish. To make sure the N95 mask you are wearing is living up to its name, though, Dr. Morgan says it must fit properly with a good seal. If you have headbands on your mask as opposed to ear loops, that's better. If you have a nose clip that can seal around your nose as opposed to one that doesn't, that is better. If you can close the gaps around your face, that will be better. Cloth masks are great because when they're dirty, you just throw them in the washing machine. But how do you know when it's time to trade out your N95 mask? You can see through it, not good. Um, and if, you, if it's soiled or visibly has holes in it or not getting a good seal, that tight fit, then you should replace it. Dr. Morgan says she would change N95 masks every two to three days. But visually, if it appears fine, can you clean your N95 mask? Doctors we talked with say you can put your N95 mask in a paper bag for a couple days and by putting it there in a dry place and away from contaminated surfaces and other people, it can in essence clean your mask. But let's be honest, wearing N95 masks for a long period of time, it's uncomfortable. An Emory University doctor I talked with said you should test out different masks. Find one that fits properly and you can also tolerate for a longer period of time and go with that mask as long as it's considered high quality. Coming up at six, how to tell if the N95 masks you're looking to buy are legitimate.